Hey there friends, it is me, HL Mod Tech, and holy cow do I have a special project for you here. This was created by an awesome student of mine named Eunice. She created the entire Five Nights at Freddy's building, and she's going to take you on a walkthrough showing you the entire thing and how it was created using Tinkercad. So my friends, let's get cracking. Hello everybody, my name is Eunice Sawala. Um, I made this Five Nights at Freddy's building. Uh, I'll show you around, I guess. Um, so it took me a while to find almost everything, especially the kitchen, since nobody actually s has seen the kitchen. This is the office where, you know, the somebody guard, if you know more about FNAF, you know <laughs> what it's for. Um, I couldn't really make the switches, they were too complicated talk about that. Um, the seal room, apparently, and there's a theory that during the first building, Puppet and Golden Freddy were actually sealed in a room, in the same room, so I basically just locked them in there. The kitchen, uh, it was hard to find, but I was based I based myself on a drawing that somebody made, so it's basically an estimate. It could really not be like that. I mean, the new VR game came out, and we won't really show much about it, but you guys, this is the um, storage room right here. Okay. This right here is the storage room. And I feel like this is the easiest room I can ever make. Um, Fox's particle doesn't really have anything. I'll show you in a little bit how I made the characters. It's obviously good just put him in there with the, his curtains. The stars, I would love to put stars in the curtains, but it was just too complicated. Too much details. Um, the body parts and service room. Um, for the ones that know about Nazar Freddy's, you know that there's an endoskeleton here. But, uh, I tried to build it, it was just too complicated to build, so I decided to not do it. After I, he doesn't really show up much during the first game. It's so creepy, but it, like, you expect it in the first game, the real game, uh, the character was so scary, and here we are, and <laughs> I think your cat making them look cute. <laughs> um, so the dining room. I think it was one of the hardest things. The party has were quite difficult as well. The chair's mm, not so much. The table co clothing, I think it's called. I don't know. Uh, the sprinkles thing. Also, the stage wasn't surprisingly difficult. Um, here, could you could look at it. It wasn't that difficult to make, surprisingly. The sun, the clouds, um, the character, the characters, I'll show you them in a while. Here's the bathrooms. And yes, I did make the girls and boys. There's only one room, they have no doors. I was too lazy with that. I'm sorry. <laughs> um, so here are the Finance of Freddy's characters. I had to make them here because it would lack too much on the other one. So, for, I'm just gonna explain for the ones that know, no, don't know about Finance of Freddy's. This right here, he is called Bunny. Bunny, um, he one of the first characters to move around the building the first night. Golden Freddy, he only appears a few times if you see his face on the camera with on the monitor or tablet that you have here. Uh, let me show you this tablet right here. Um, Freddy doesn't really move much until Final Freddy's uh, night four and five, I think. Chica, she also she also moves a lot during the all the nights 
Foxy, you just barely have to watch him on the curtains. Actually, now that I think about it, I forgot to put the cameras, but I don't know how the cameras look. Mm, too much detail. The poster actually has a backstory. So the characters that are on the stage, I actually had to squish them <laughs> a lot in order for them to fit. You can basically see that. It's, it's supposed to look uh, scary and all, but it, like Mr. Hummin said, it looks <laughs> just adorable. Um, Thanks for watching. So friends, if you're a Five Nights at Freddy's fan or just a person that enjoyed watching Eunice share all these cool details, please give the video a thumbs up. Give her a shout out in the comments below. If you got a question or a comment, you can add that as well. If you haven't subscribed yet, what are you waiting for? Smash that subscribe button. And last but not least, hit the notification bell if you want to be the first to know when there's a brand new video from me, HL Mod Tech. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.